I'm always like, am I recording? Yeah, I don't, I just... <laughs> <sighs> Welcome to Puzzle with Emilia. That's me and on today's video we're gonna do the impossible Ravensburger Golden Crypt Puzzle which is just one solid color, 631 pieces of just golden. Don't let the box fool you because for real it looks more like this. This puzzle has been on my bucket list for quite long and to be honest I have been a little bit hesitant to get it started but now it's the right time. Make a guess how many days this will take me or how many hours and let's see if I can live up to your expectations. So let's take the first look. This is going to be pretty amazing. Okay. And apparently we have here a puzzle guide. Guide. I think this is the cheat code. Um, you can see it's unopened. I am not going to open it. I'm going to do this without it. And if you're now like, okay, tell us about your plan. Well, I don't have one. Okay. I do not have a plan. I have absolutely no idea what am I going to do. I'm gonna do something. You have to start with something. Let's start by putting this... Actually, I'm not even sure if the cover is gonna help me. Is it gonna help me? Is the back is going to help me? Actually, isn't this also the cheat code? Isn't it? Okay. Well, you know what? We are not going to use anything, so I don't need this. This puzzle holder is for nothing. This is for nothing. Let's put it here. Okay. Um, first of all, I have to say I was a little bit surprised with the color. I thought this is a little bit more golden. A little bit more golden based on, on the box. But obviously it's fine because it's still the... Everything is still exactly the same. Same color. What am I doing? Okay, I'm just gonna flip. But I can already see, like, I'm, I'm very unsure with these pieces because, for example, is this like a, is, is this like an edge piece? I mean, I, I think it's not because it looks like, oh, I'm sorry, this way. <laughs> it looks like this, but I mean, hypothetically, it could go like this way. So it could be an edge piece. See, I don't think I'm gonna do other puzzles on this table for any time soon. <laughs> Thank God I can do puzzles here. By the way, I just borrowed this from uh, one of my clients, um, CEO actually. Very cute puzzle. I love doing these uh, old puzzles. This is like from catalog of 2003. I think they should reproduce these for the worlds instead of the new puzzles. But anyway, back to this. I would assume that starting kind of like from the middle is the best way to go, but I'm not exactly sure if I will find the middle pieces too easily. Yoo-hoo! I found the middle piece. Dun, 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 dun. Hmm. This might be a lucky one. But then on the other hand, I'm still not 100% sure because sometimes wrong pieces are just attached in the box because they're so mixed. But I'm gonna put it this to the safe because I feel like it actually might be a right fit. And hey, 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 this goes here. Yes. Look, we are already doing progress. Like after, I don't know what, 10, 5 minutes, we already have four pieces together. I think so. Maybe. Okay, what next? I thought I was like super super duper smart because I was like I found this and I was like oh okay so the edges look like this. Unfortunately this is only this looking piece that I found. So either I'm blind, very possible, I'm not wearing my glasses. Um, 
because I mean I can see a shape I cannot see the details but it's not like there's too many details here actually maybe this one actually goes Ooh. wow hey 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 look I feel like I'm gonna do a new record with this like I'm getting so fast already yeah oh my god this chair is killing me Oh, okay, so I already have something wrong because this is definitely going here. Which means that this is wrong. This is wrong. Maybe here? 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 No? Okay. Could I have something else wrong as well? I mean, it wasn't like a false fit, it was very clear it didn't fit. But obviously when you don't really see where the angle is going, so... Angle sounds so wrong. Maybe somebody understood what I was trying to say. I'm so confused. Mm. Okay, I admit this is... This is a little bit hard, yeah? Yeah? Should I maybe look for the edges? I still don't know what the edges look like. Is there supposed to be a corner piece somewhere? Like four corner pieces? Because I ain't seeing any. Oh, this is an edge. Oh! Oh! This looks right. Right? Oh, fuck. Oops. Is this a corner piece? I mean, it could, could be, who is this? Oh, okay. Oh, I have, okay. So I have one, two, three layers from the, from the centrum outwards. Done. Yeah. Must go somewhere. Could this be wrong though? Still wouldn't go there, so... I think I'm gonna call it a day. So this was the day one and we have 30 pieces in, which means that we have 601 to go. Okay, it's day two and it's becoming more clear that I do need some kind of plan with this. Because otherwise I will just keep looking at the same pieces all over and again. So I'm going to collect all the pieces that hypothetically could be the edge pieces. Because I don't see any other option here. And maybe I will be also able to find my missing circle pieces while I go through everything for the possible edges. So the setup is a little bit different uh, because this is my kitchen table where it's usually located. And when I film, I usually put it there because then the natural light is like looking nice. But Finland is already getting so dark. There is no point of even trying to benefit that natural light because there isn't any. That's why. I'm still feeling a little bit that I want to have the cheat code, but I'm really trying. Let's. You know, let's at least start with this, and if this doesn't go anywhere, um, I at least still have the option, so I think it's good to have. Makes you feel a little bit more calm with this. What the heck am I doing? I could definitely recommend that if you ever do this puzzle, then you probably want to like, make sure you have space somewhere else to do other smaller puzzles, or you know, easier puzzles important for your mental health decides to do like something else as well because this is quite a lot I, I have to say this is quite a lot even if you're like experienced puzzler this is this is quite a challenge let's put it that way okay so I think all of these are indeed the edge pieces because there's not too many options and basing on the size, 
I think this is exactly the amount uh, that it requires each pieces. So let's see if I can figure these things out. If you lose one of these these pieces, and then you would like never finish it because there wasn't like all the pieces. That would be that would be terrible. Okay, so this is it for day two. Uh, not too much progress. I just wanted to show you another puzzle I've been doing. So this is what I've been doing today. Well, been doing. I did it like in 57 minutes. Just to keep it sane from this nonsense. And this is like, this is the midday in Finland. So yeah. That's the amount of sun we have right now. It is day three or technically day four. I skipped one day. If I'm 100% honest, I'm not really enjoying this. I don't know what did I expect or if I even had any expectations, but I think jumping from all the speed buzzing that, but that I've been doing in the days is not very enjoyable for me. Like, I just feel like I have no idea what am I like doing with this. Like, I, I feel like I don't even understand these edge pieces um, or anything. But, you know, let's see what kind of progress and I can I can I la 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 can <laughs> done today. I'll be doing this for maybe half an hour or hour. We'll see. I'll be attaching it here. Yes. So this is it for the day three. I think some puzzle cards answered to my questions because I think I got the most progress done today to the middle and the assumed edge pieces. I think I'm gonna need some help. It's day four. I've skipped two days so far. Yeah. Otherwise this would be day six. Yeah. And we have Daniel here to give his two cents or five cents, you said you wanted to give five cents instead. Go. I have absolutely no <laughs> idea how to proceed with this. I don't know. Like, for me, it would be like trial and error until I finish this puzzle. But it could take months. <laughs> In my case. Instead of doing the trial and error, because we have also other life, I don't know what the other life is. Doing the weekend puzzle, for example. <laughs> yeah. So I ask for tips on my Instagram account and we're going to go through them. So if I read the tips and then you see if we can already execute it. Yeah. Okay, let's go. The thing is that I, I put there that, you know, like share your tips and please share even if you have never done this group puzzle. <laughs> yeah. So not all of the, the tips might be, we need to a little bit analyze if the tip is like, Super relevant, but I think it's always yeah. good to have a good idea. Good ideas. Good ideas. Yes, also good ideas, but also like new ideas. New ideas. Okay, yeah. so <coughs> <laughs> we have a first one uh, who says that sorry, I did not finish it. I started with the center, it was okay, but then I did not have patience with it. Good luck. Yeah, I think that's already a really good tip, which I mean, is having patience. <laughs> I mean, I started from the center as well. I think this is the ultimate patience, the patient. I feel like... Patient. Yeah, I know, I know. Patience. But when I start the word, it feels sane to me. And then patient. I'm like... Yeah, <clears throat> yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you right. Yeah, okay, like... then people said when I got stuck, I used the puzzle guide. But we kind of wanted to open it in the end. Mm. So I'm still trying at least two more days. Because I kind of want to open it in the end. I have no idea what the puzzle guide is, if it's like a blueprint or is it like step-by-step -step, uh, IKEA instructions. Put this piece in the yeah. yeah. People made copies and highlight, blah, 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 blah. Uh, make a pile of pieces with uh, some type of curve and double pieces, the, the small ones and the big ones. Well, I have here all the curvy ones and then we have the edges. I have no idea. What is a double piece? Is this a double piece? I think so. Because if you cut it in half, then it will be looking like two pieces, right? 
Yeah, okay, I think the small ones and the big ones. Does the small one and the big one refer now to the double pieces or in Here, general this, uh, all the pieces? Small pieces, I suppose. And then there is the you chunky ones. Okay, because there's a lot of people to say short by short by shape, and I I already said like I don't understand like it's it's annoying to me because I feel like there is like seventy hundred and fifty yeah thousand million two and one different shapes here. I so. think that one thing about the sorting by shape is that, for example, we know that this one the center is supposed to start getting squarish in some point, so. I suppose that these ones that are more flat will be the ones that are, you know, shaping it into a squarish looking yeah. thingy. And then there's one saying my first time I had to use the bottom map they gave you. Uh, so, okay, a lot of like a short... Uh, <laughs> Basically, people are just recommending that you should sort. But let's see if there's something else because I don't... I don't have the patience to do all the sorting here. So yeah, there is a lot of sorting. more sorting. A lot of people saying start from the center. That it's exactly where I started. So at least I'm somehow on the right path from the beginning. I would say. Yeah. Uh, okay, this is interesting. Okay, okay. There's one who says, listen to this. Let's listen. Let's now we need to visualize. I think this one gets divided in, in four sections. Big circle piece for corners. Big circle piece for corners. So small small circle piece for centers. Okay, so yeah. I have a center. We got but the, apparently there is another circle. Yeah, I think that there once you are having the middle shape, there is an external circle. Okay, so and we have two circles. Have, this one would be for the external circle. Okay. And that's what big, I think. Big straight pieces on the sides. Big so? straight pieces on the side and small straight pieces to the square of the central circle. You see? It would be like... I suppose that it, this one did, did you be. Did you hear this? Yeah. Big straight pieces on the sides. I assume yeah. this is talking about the middle pieces. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And small straight pieces to the square of the central center. Does that mean I am very that all of... By the last one. Okay. <laughs> small straight pieces. Is this small straight pieces? I think that this is small, yes. The square of the central center. Is it that one? Yes. Does it mean that everything that looks like this actually goes to one area and everything that is big goes to one area? Uh, is that what I'm understanding here? But this could be also... I, I don't know. Okay, but I, I'm a little this, bit this now, could be something. I, I'm a little bit confused by the last part. But this is the same person who says that it divides in four sections. Yeah, yeah. So this is kind of making somehow a little bit sense to me. Yeah, I, I think that that person is very on point on this one, although it, it's hard to see it without seeing the picture or whatsoever. So... Okay, and then, okay. So I also understood from these comments that apparently every crypt, because there's multiple in the series, have a different cut. So there might be somebody who is actually having done the same group, doesn't know that the cut is different. So we need to be a little bit careful here. Because there's one, but it's somebody who said that this one is especially difficult. Oh, the, because the edges don't interlock. Yeah, this one. So okay, this is so for they the go outer like, circle. So they yeah. go somehow like... So this is supposed to have a circle. You see what I'm talking about? Something like this. Yeah, but also like that they go somehow good. Uh, this doesn't look straight, no, but somehow it yeah. goes like this. This is this supposed to. I don't uh, know which one you is know, it this it one. It would frame a circle, so so it should be a really big circle. Probably. Yeah, I know, but the edges in itself, yeah. like they could attach already here, but it just like it doesn't interlock. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. That, that's what I understood from that as well. I I suppose that this one would be for this uh, side. That's what I understood. Uh, I understand from this. People also say here a lot of like, you can study the cut pattern. Like, do they mean that you can somehow study it this way? Or do they mean that you look at the, the box? Or are they referring to the puzzle guide? 
I have absolutely because no I idea. still don't know what is the puzzle guide actually including and I'm really trying not so so there's like a surprise and then I will be like oh <laughs> yeah, okay and then people that. say that the mm, Okay, so somebody said that uh, the lighter pieces seems often easier to spot among dark ones. These pieces are exactly the same color, every each one of these. So there is no lighter or darker pieces. But I do know this series does have uh, a gradient yeah. version. So I think they may have done that, and I think we should have probably started with that. But I think that at least for as a way to go, now would be to make this as a big circle yeah and that would be like the first part so i think that the, that would be something to go with so at least we'll have the edges and we'll have like a certain idea of how big the circle is supposed to be outside yeah. and then start dividing it to the sections as the other person said and then sorting out the pieces i think that would be Okay, then plan. this is the best tip of the world. <laughs> Put it back into the box. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I already thought about that, but I started already filming, so there is like no way at this point you go back. There is no going back with this. Uh, but anyway, then there is like a long message I received, um, who also pointed out that the, she loves the series. So this is a confirmation there is different cuts. For, for different crypt. Um, so how you should uh, sort what she's recommending is like the regular pieces and then all the pieces that are like these double pieces that somebody else also um, said. Mm. Um, yeah, then you can also help to divide with those categories by size or how curvy they are. Yeah. Because the spiral is in the middle and then I think somebody said that there was also the other spiral and then there's like, is there then like two squares? Uh, I something think that, like that. Yeah, I think that it's supposed to be like a spiral in the middle and then it goes to a square. And then there is an outer uh, circle and then it goes also to square. Okay. So this part would be squarish and then the outer area would be curvy and then the curvy parts will go to the corners. So basically in the middle where we have the center, we have under it is the regular pieces. Mm. Is that what you're saying? And then the curves are coming again from here. Yeah, so we need to, the straight pieces. So the small be, pieces are boxing this. I think so, I'm not sure. I, I think the small pieces would be considered something like this that would uh, frame it. But I... So basically, well, that was like all the tips. And I told you like yesterday that I, I feel a little bit sad, I think, because I always do a puzzle and then I tell the tips for it, no matter if it's like a hard puzzle whatsoever. But this is going to be like a tipless puzzle, puzzle video because I don't have any tips. I'm completely confused. But thank God the puzzle community came for, for, the, for the... Rescue. For the rescue, yes. Um, so let's see, we're going to now use the tips and let's see how is going to be the progress of this day four or six if we calculate the day offs. Okay, so the day four actually is um, done with Daniel. Uh, this is the interview. How was it, Daniel? Very confusing. But I think at least we started to get the, the pieces started. So we would be able to proceed from that point. Uh, and who is we? We is Emilia and myself. So you are also going to help me with this on the day other days. <laughs> now I'm realizing what did I sign up for? <laughs> um, <laughs> I Any um last words for this day four or or uh, uh greetings for the audience, yes. 
Greetings to the audience, yes. Fara. We should have taken the green crypt. The Gary screen, right? I don't know what you're talking about, but yes, yes to that. Okay, people, here's the deal. My motivation is not to the roof, and this is taking much more time than I anticipated. So, there's going to be part two, don't worry. And please share all your tips and ideas, thoughts in the comments. Uh, let me also know, should I open the puzzle guide? I still don't know what it is, but obviously people have been sending me some tips already. So I have an idea what's in there. I'm still vibing that I'm not going to open it until this is ready. But let me know what you think and I will see you next time. Bye bye. What video is it? Was it? No, it wasn't the field. What did you give him? I don't know. What was it? Was it the carrot? Is the carrot still there? I don't know, I thought he ate before we went to the chop. <laughs>